Hello? Hello? Okay. Good. You're here. Okay. I'm so glad you're here. I, I, look, I really need your help. I said I probably said that like 50 times already. Alright. So let me explain. I know I'm gonna sound crazy. But. Whew, let me just say. I've been experiencing some things here lately. That aren't good. Something unspeakably, unspeakably evil. Just thinking about it, talking about it, makes my words stumble, mess up on what I say. Ugh. I'll, I'll talk to you. Alright. This place is haunted. I don't care what you think. I don't care what your opinion is. All I know is that the dang place is haunted as heck. Whew. I'll explain why. So, after, you know, the creator of Godzilla King of the Monsters Pizza has gone missing, um, they chose me, his neighbor, by the way, which is interesting. Never thought I'll be this guy's neighbor. They chose me. To take control of the house. Since I just moved out. Out of my other house. Close to him. You know. What have I been experiencing at this dang house. For the last month. <sighs> it's not so good. Something. Some very paranormal events started happening. F random footsteps around the house. Heavy ones. Seeing things from the corner of my eye. Things being knocked over, glasses being broken, dishes being thrown around. And I chose you to be, to help me. So. Little info. Okay, so remember what we said last year, that... By the way, I'm kind of working with these guys, too. So that's why, if you're wondering, that's why I say that. So yeah. Turns out, we we opened it this year. The Godzilla and Monsters Pizzeria Place. With Hotel Transylvania and Shrek on the side. Along with the King of Skull Island, Island himself, Kong. Celebration of Godzilla vs. Kong coming out later this year. And, you know, this has not been an easy year so far, let's just say that. Especially for me, in the midst of all this happening, yeah. So, turns out, one of the animatronics attacked a person in the restaurant, and just... Bit out their frontal lobe. <sighs> Disturbing sight, I know. But, uh. Then they closed down the place again. Yeah. But in the meantime. They asked me to have you have the night watch at this dude's house to see if anything happens, because, you know, this guy is popular. And, you know. It's very serious. People have been reportedly seeing the Shrek animatronic peeking over a fence in this dude's backyard, and the Johnny animatronic staring at somebody from the, you know, one of the bottom floor windows. This house only has one floor, actually. So what am I saying? And some people are reporting also seeing the Rodan animatronic in some of the windows. So yeah. But who caused the frontal lobe? We don't know. Because, you know, the frontal lobe problem I just talked about. We don't know who caused it. It, it could have been Goji himself, uh, Dracula, or Shrek. It could have been either of them. Or either of them. All the animatronics, either of them. You close the place down, 
and in the midst of, you know, when I was doing, doing what I was doing, watching the house, house sitting, and then that's when all these paranormal events start to happen. I'm just warning you, be careful. I'll give off some hints what you need to do. Okay, I hooked up cameras around the house. Cost plenty of money. So, yeah. So, you can flip up the monitor in your bedroom. In this bedroom. The main one, mostly. Which is a tablet. It's not even a monitor, basically. But, it's just a tablet. But, you can check your tablet to check the cameras around the house. Sometimes you'll get a bird's eye view of everything, and sometimes little corners here and there. But trust me, you're going to need this tablet to check the cameras. Because soon there is going to be a big threat coming your way, and be prepared for it. I'm going to give fair warning. You might be paranoid as I am after this, after these five days of a shift. And to keep whatever things out of your room, go up to the door and try to push on it to prevent them from coming in. You deserve to know this so you can defend yourself and I'm not the only one on this. But you're going to be the only person that possibly believes me after this shift. And the other four ones after this one. Trust me. After your shift, uh, I'm planning to have a priest come over this house to bless the house. <sighs> it's just, it's just that bad. So, you can check around the house, the living room, dining area, you know, garage, hallways, bathrooms, and such. But as little baby steps in my previous nights, they seem to be going, getting worse and worse and worse. You'll see what I mean. Now, that's all I gotta talk to you for now. Um, you know, good luck. Be warned, be prepared. I'm not lying. I repeat, be prepared. This isn't a joke. This isn't funny. Be ready. And remember, keep them whatever those unspeakably evil things out of your room by using the door. It may sound dumb, may not work in horror movies most of the time, but trust me, I have tried it myself and it actually surprisingly worked. Good luck. You're gonna need it.